the format of being robot. Nothing matters more to me than ensuring my child is safe and happy. Recently though, my worst nightmare became a reality, when I discovered my daughter had stumbled upon a twisted and dark version of her favorite children's show. It all started when I heard strange sounds coming from her room. Alarmed, I went to investigate and saw her watching Coco Melon on her tablet. But something was amiss. As I looked over her shoulder, I saw the characters engaging in violent acts. Their actions were completely different from the innocent and wholesome content I was used to. Terrified, I grabbed the tablet away from her, hoping to erase the disturbing images from her mind. Unfortunately, my efforts were in vain. The next day, I learned that my daughter had found a fake version of Coco Melon online. To my horror, this version featured graphic violence and disturbing images. She had become hooked on the twisted content, unable to look away from the screen whenever the opportunity arose. I was at a loss about what to do. My daughter had developed an insatiable appetite for this fake version of her favorite show, and it was tearing our family apart. I felt powerless to stop the damage that had already been done. As I write this, I can't help but feel like I have failed as a parent. My goal is to prevent other families from falling into this kind of nightmare. It's essential that we monitor the content our children are accessing online. The internet is a dangerous place for the unsuspecting, and we need to take necessary precautions to protect our young ones.